Okay guys, I'm gonna demonstrate how to use the inch and a half. Inch equals a foot in the architectural scale. And I'm gonna grab my scale. And I'm gonna find the inch and a half mark on my scale. And I can see right here that it's inch and a half. And I see that I want inch and a half equals a foot. And I can see that I have three, six, nine, which is gonna make that 12. And if that's one, there's one, two, three, there's four between every inch and 12 of them. So I can tell I have 48 divisions. So I know this is gonna equal a foot, just like in class. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use my gross measurement, right? Which in this case starts here because I see two and two. Well, I know zero, I know that's gotta be one because that's an inch and a half and that's the same distance and that's the same distance. So I'm gonna put my gross measurement mark, which is two on that mark two, which I know stands for one. So that's gonna be one foot. And I know this represents a foot and these are 12 inches. So I can see that that's three, four, five and a quarter inches. Let's look at the next one. It's also gonna be one foot because it lands on the same mark, but it is only gonna be three and three quarter inches. Whoops, should be one foot, three and three quarter inches. And that should be one foot. All right. That's how you would do the one and a half inch equals a foot.